I bought 14 torpedo levels for $529. I did that so that I can compare them side by side and give you a top seven ranking. Also, I'm finally gonna settle the age old debate, which torpedo level has the strongest magnet under the sun. And there's a level behind me that isn't even on the market yet. It's a prototype. I'm gonna reveal that in just a second. You'll probably see a few levels you weren't familiar with. And by the end, you'll be able to confidently choose the best level for your application. Number seven, the rigid eight inch machined aluminum five vial level. It's the only level on the list with five vials. There were several criteria for consideration on this list. All levels must have magnets, a pipe groove, and a flat side. They must be pocket friendly while having a minimum of three vials, a zero degree, 90 degree, and a 45 degree. About half of the levels have no more than three vials. The other half have a 30 degree bubble as well. But the Rigid is the only torpedo to include a dedicated 22 and a half degree bubble. Also note that you can see the zero degree and the 22.5 degree from all four sides. It does have slope markings from one eighth up to a half, but the only zero degree bubble is the slope vial. So that's a little bit unique. It has three rare earth magnets on the bottom. They claim accuracy to one thousandth per inch. The rigid comes with a wrist strap, but it does look removable. And there isn't much I would change about this level aside from the $62 price tag that makes it the second most expensive on the list. It's made in Taiwan. I don't see many of these on site but it is a high quality level, so I'm looking forward to carrying it in the future. Did you know they're called spirit levels because of the mineral spirits or alcohols typically used in the vials? Alcohols have a lower surface tension and viscosity than water, allowing the bubble to move more freely. They also have additives that give color as well as resistance to freezing and fading in the sun. Number six, the Klein Tools 8 inch aluminum billet torpedo level. Klein makes some high quality tools and their torpedo level is no exception. It has four rare earth magnets that supposedly won't fall out due to the patented magnetic track. Furthermore, after rigorous scientific testing, the Klein was proven to have the second strongest magnets of all the levels, even stronger than the Stabilo or the Flange Wizard. You'll see who takes the strongest magnet award once we get inside the top five. It's accurate to 0 0.029 degrees, has a very reasonable price tag of $30. I would like to see some slope markings, but I guess slope isn't a real high priority for those sparkies. They do make a nearly identical conduit level with a thumb screw, uh, as well as a version of this that lights up. That one is $6 more, and they are all made in China. Speaking of light up levels, I have two levels here that didn't quite make the list, but are solid options as well. It's the Southwire 9 inch torpedo level and the Savage Lightning from Swanson. And for some unknown reason, they are basically the same level. I mean, they're the exact same size and shape with identical vials and markings and light buttons as well. The only visible difference is the Southwire has squared off corners while the Savage has more rounded corners. If anyone knows what's up, with that let me know they aren't owned by the same company uh, savage is a swanson product and southwire is a family-owned company so maybe they just happen to be made in the same facility they are both made in china regardless the savage is tied for cheapest level of them all at 22 dollars and the southwire is in the middle of the pack at 37 dollars so that should make a decision between the identical twins pretty easy check out this chart that puts a visual on the price tags of every level i looked at also, all the pricing I'm using is Amazon pricing just for the sake of a fair comparison. I did link all the levels behind me here in my Amazon storefront down below. Another thing about the Klein level that I didn't mention is the aggressive 45 degree angle machined out of the level. Most levels have a 45 or 30 degree taper built in either to help it slide into your pocket or to check level in a small area. The only one longer than the Klein is on the tough built nine inch billet aluminum torpedo level with three rare earth magnets, an eight inch ruler and a notch out of the middle for a weld or a pipe strap or something. The tough build is a solid option as well. At $23, it's just a dollar away from being the cheapest. If you care about magnets though, they're not ideal. They are actually the second weakest overall. And they also claim 0 0.029 degrees of accuracy. Speaking of magnets, before we crack the top five, I wanna do a brand new tool reveal. This is a prototype of a level that isn't even in production yet. It's from a company called Stalwart Tool Co. and it is made right here in the USA. It's a heavy duty laser cut zinc coated steel sandwiched by stainless steel and it's called the Magneto. I'll show you why that is the strongest magnet on a level I've ever seen and it's not even close. That plate weighs nine and a half pounds. I think this is a beast and looks sweet. They actually wanted me to ask for your feedback so please let me know what you think in the comments and keep an eye on their website. Uh, I did not include this thing in my ranking, and the strongest magnet on a level currently available, like I said, is inside the top five. Number five, Stabila's 10-inch torpedo level, 81SV REM W360. One of two cast aluminum levels that I looked at, and the only one in the top five. It has a machined flat side with an integrated pipe groove and one strong rare earth magnet. The 360 in the name is for the angle finder feature that lets you find degrees of slope. And if you look closely, you can see that they've highlighted the 45 degree and 22 and a half degree markings. The zero degree bubble also has gradient lines for one and two degrees of pitch as well. Stabila is a German company and known for their high quality levels and they claim a half a thousandth per inch. It's the only torpedo that comes with a belt pouch. 
Also on the pricier side at $61, making it the third most expensive on the list, along with being the second heaviest. They also make a similar version where the 360 degree vial is replaced with a fixed 45. It is a high quality level, although I don't love the shape and I don't love the single magnet, even though it's the fifth strongest on the list. The only other cast aluminum level that I looked at also has one rare earth magnet. It's the Sola. It's a little bigger and bulkier. It is the heaviest on the list. Just check out this weight chart that shows just how much heavier it is than the rest. Not very pocket friendly, and I'm not sure how I feel about the sides of the vials being so tinted. Comes in at a whopping $68, making it the most expensive on the list. And it's the only level made in Hungary. Number four, it's the Milwaukee seven inch billet torpedo level. It's very lightweight. In fact, it's the third lightest on the list. And I appreciate the notch that allows me to slap this thing right over a weld, just like the tough built. Eighth inch and quarter inch slope markings and it's machined so that you could even lay it sideways on large diameter piping. One of six levels with laser etched ruled edge is a very reasonable $36 and it has four rare earth magnets. And this is the level that tops the chart when it comes to magnet strength excluding the magneto uh, this is a video of all the levels lined up in order of magnet strength from the milwaukee down to the weakest which is the short black level the milwaukee is stronger than the klein stabila and flange wizard one knock on this level that i've heard a few times is that the magnets can fall out if dropped i haven't experienced this myself but it is worth noting also made in vietnam the Milwaukee is tied for shortest on the list. It's one of two that are only seven inches long, the other being from Strong Hand Tools. It has the same three bubbles, but very small vials, and only two magnets which are on the other end of the spectrum from the Milwaukee. They are the weakest magnets I looked at overall. A unique feature this level has is the 90 degree removable bubble that sticks out of the side, allowing you to level two axes at one time. I'm only a little skeptical that the rubber gaskets wouldn't wear out over time, causing this feature to lose accuracy, but it's a cool feature nonetheless. And when removed, it becomes the lightest level on the list, just barely edging out the number one ranked level. Another unique feature is the quarter inch chamfer, making for easy alignment to your workpiece. There are two more magnets on that side of the level as well. And the Velcro strap stored in the center allows you to strap it firmly to non-magnetic surfaces. So lots of unique features here, but the weak magnets and the small vials knock it down a few pegs, and it's made in China. Number three, the Green Lee nine inch billet torpedo level. Four rare earth magnets tied for third place in strength and four vials with a slope mark on the zero degree. But what stands out about this level is the plumb view with a mirror right next to the 90 degree bubble, allowing you to see all four vials from the top and the side. It's the only level that can do that. That's going to come in handy when plumbing a pipe north and south, east and west, when you can't move to see it from the side. Has a built-in 45 degree angle for bending offsets and an etched ruler and a removable wrist strap. It's made in China and costs 46 bucks. There is another level similar to the Greenlee. It's the Bethel 9-inch torpedo level. It's the same size, a similar shape, a touch lighter with similar vials. The major difference being no mirror for the 90 degree, also no wrist strap, and much weaker magnets. If you don't care about the mirror, the Bethel is a cheaper alternative at $22. They also make a 6-inch and a 2.5-inch conduit level with a thumb screw in the same style as this. Number two, you already know there's gonna be a Flange Wizard on the list. This is Flange Wizard's nine inch aluminum pocket level or SL100 and it's made from aircraft aluminum. It's kind of a minimalistic level with no 30 degree for the electricians and no slope markings. It is the third heaviest on the list thanks in part to the four inch long magnet that's tied with the Green Lee in strength. Flange Wizard is known for their high quality pipe fitting tools and this along with the Stabila are gonna take the win for accuracy. Flange Wizard does sell vial repair kits for field repairing the level and the SL100 is surprisingly affordable at $36. And you could upgrade to the Pocket Pro level or the PP200 if you want the added angle finder protractor feature. But it's a little big for everyday pocket carry and it costs over 60 bucks. And both of these options are made right here in the good old US of A. And the number one all around pocket carry torpedo level that money can buy is coming up in two seconds. But first I need to give out an honorable mention. I had this level on my previous top five ranking, but that was before I introduced a few of the other levels. It's the old reliable Empire True Blue eight inch magnetic billet torpedo level. This is also a solid choice. I would probably rank this one eighth it is the only level with a dedicated slope vial and like the rigid it has eighth inch through half inch per foot lines files are accurate to a half a thousandth and some are made in china while some are made in taiwan the one knock on this level is the blue tinted liquid in the vials can make it a little tough to see in low light however they claim the blue edge on the bubble makes it easier to see at 27 dollars, it's one of the cheapest on the list and readily available at home depot and many other hardware stores they also make a six inch conduit variation 
Again, this level is a favorite for a lot of people. It's just with so many good levels at the top, I'm not sure which I would knock out in favor of the Empire. Just one more friendly reminder that all of these levels, as well as most of the tools that I use, are in my Amazon storefront linked in the description below. Just click on the top ranked tool section of my storefront. Also, if you hate this style of comparison and ranking video, be sure to not subscribe. But I would like to do some more of these in the future if there is some interest. Number one. The top level on the list is sleek, smooth, ergonomic, and incredibly lightweight. It's the Checkpoint Ultramag G3 8.5 inch torpedo level. It's very affordable at $29, comes in four colors, blue, green, red, silver, made from 6061 aluminum alloy with a removable wrist strap. Three of the vials are on the smaller side, but the zero degree is larger than the rest. I'm pretty sure it's made in Taiwan. The overall weight makes it the second lightest on the list, which is impressive considering that it isn't one of the shorter ones. I've actually adjusted the weights of all the levels for how long they are, giving them a gram per inch value. That's right, imperial and metric. And as you can see, the checkpoint is definitely the lightest once adjusted. The magnets are above average and tied for six with the Empire. The checkpoint just has the best feel and is the most carryable of all the levels. Drop your favorite multi-tool in the comments and maybe I'll rank those next. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something and I hope you come back for the next tool ranking. Until then, I'm Drew and I'm Building America.